Environmental groups are condemning Governor Ron DeSantis for signing a bill they say would harm environmentally sensitive areas in the state. As Jake Stofan tells us, the law orders the beginning of planning for three new roads through mostly rural parts of Florida. The largest road project in the state since the 1950s has been set in motion. The Florida Chamber of Commerce says it will ease congestion and bring more businesses to rural counties. Infrastructure is the lifeblood of an economy. The law earmarks $45 million to begin the planning process for creating a new toll road from Collier to Polk County, connecting the Turnpike to the Suncoast Parkway and extending the parkway to the Florida Georgia line. A leaky Moncrief with the Florida conservation voters worries the new roads could devastate ecosystems in the mostly rural lands. The state would be destroying wetlands and so you're destroying habitat for all the animals but you're also destroying wetlands that help protect our drinking water supplies. The plan includes environmental impact studies prior to breaking ground but Jordan Lipman with Earth Justice is concerned the studies will be treated only as a formality. And it will really remain to be seen who is allowed to participate in the task forces. The road extensions were the top priority for Senate President Bill Galvano, but he'll be long out of office before construction set to begin. But with the support of the three legislators next in line for president, Galvano says he's confident the project will be seen through to completion. If we're breaking ground by uh, 2023, once, once that's on its way, it's on its way. Spending on the project is set to increase incrementally, reaching $140 million a year in 2022 until the scheduled completion date in 2030. Reporting from the state capitol, Jake Stofan, Channel 4, The Local Station.